Hello everyone and welcome back to WD Sports. Today we are bringing you more action from the Southern Central Division. And it's FC Romania taking on Kempston Rovers. FC Romania with a win today will have the chance to really put themselves into contention for the playoff places. It's been a really interesting season so far and it's definitely hotting up in that region of the table. Well, here come Kempston Rovers early on here and it's a dangerous attack for FC Romania. They need to defend it and they almost don't and it's almost a goal as well. Fantastic effort just wide. Well, here they come and here's Coco and he's in here and it's a great chance. Pokes it past the goalkeeper. Oh and it's wide. Oh, he had fans celebrating there. Hudson. Oh, a driven kick that's maybe been picked up by the win there. And they can come forward here, Kempston, yet again. And it's a good effort from distance. Just over. I think it was Caleb Steele with the effort. FC Romania keep the ball in here. And it's a good cross and it falls to them. Still in the penalty area. The effort's saved. And just about managed to scramble it away. And the corner's taken short. Still Leonidas. Crosses it in. It's blocked. Comes back to Coker. Coker strikes it straight at Hudson. That's another corner. This time from the far side. It's whipped in and not really headed away. And it's blocked. Shouts of handball. And the referee's given it. It's a penalty. Still Leonidas to step up. And scores brilliantly into the bottom corner. 1-0 to FC Romania with 13 minutes played. And a fantastic start for the away side. Well worked goal to get the penalty. Maybe a slightly fortuitous call that Kempston Rovers defender was very close to the shot. But still Unitas made no mistake from the spot. Well, here FC Romania come again. And there's Griffiths. Griffith takes on his man and beats him as well. Griffith still going. Gets the ball in. Oh, and it's two. Wonderfully worked goal. Fantastic wing back play. And a fantastic finish as well. Kieran Bishop, the number nine, getting the second of the game for the away side. But how about that for a cross? Too much pace from Griffith and a fantastic delivery as well. That's a good free kick. Well struck and well saved. Really decent save. And Coker and a lot of Lodovica are locked in a bit of a duel there. Oh, there's a kick out there, I think, after the challenge. It's going to be a yellow card. Maybe lucky to get away with that one. The corner's played short again. Mixing it up with the corners. Oh, that's a good little dummy as well. And he's into the penalty area here. Oh, what a goal. A sumptuous third and it's Stylianidis again. It's his second of the match. And FC Romania are in total control here. Wonderfully worked yet again. Those corners have been very fruitful for them in this game. Played short. Stylianidis sells his man with the little fake shot into the penalty area. And that's a beautiful finish into the bottom far corner. Oh, Romania really could put Kempston to the sword here. And they're again going into the penalty area with plenty of space. The cross is deflected and it falls to Stylianidis who somehow puts it in for four. And it's a hat-trick for the number 10 in the first half. And that is one of the more unusual goals we will see this season. The cross took a deflection. I think he tried to head it and sort of just fell over. And in the end, the ball just hit his head and caught the goalkeeper off guard. Let's have another look at it. Oh, he tries to side-foot it in. In the end, just falls over. And uh, the ball falls perfectly for him to nod in. Well, here they come again, FC Romania. This could be a cricket score. Oh, and it's deflected just wide. Kempston need to get a hold of this game. 
Oh, lovely back heel. And a chance now for Coker to get into the penalty area. Brought down. Has to be a penalty, surely. The referee's given a free kick. And the free kick hits the wall. And it's going to be cleared away. Griffith. Coker. Those two combining well on the near side. Still working it well, and it's a fantastic ball through as well. Oh, and it's oh, it's gone in eventually. It's five nil in the first half, and still Leonidas has got a fourth. It was nice intricate play. Anthony Edgar with the ball through, and I think Coker might have tried to no that's definitely a cross I thought it might have been a shot at first definitely a cross and the goalkeeper in the end Hudson couldn't keep it over the line that's a very very successful first half for FC Romania and there is the half time whistle 5-0 at the break Scintillating stuff from the away side. Four for Zen and Stylianidis. And this result is surely in the bag now for FC Romania. And a great chance now for them to push for the playoffs. Kempston Rovers, meanwhile, really struggled in this one. They've had a few glimpses of attacking promise, but overall haven't been able to cope with the pace and the football speed of the football from FC Romania. Well, Kempston get us underway for the second half. And it's a fantastic chance for FC Romania to maybe boost their goal difference in the second half if they can keep the pressure up. And they're putting pressure on the ball here and they've nipped in as well. Oh, and... Maybe not quite the quality in the finish from Bishop. He's already got one to his name. Well, here come Kempston. Rare sight of goal for them, and it's a lovely bit of run play as well. Still going, and the shot is well saved. Great bit of dribbling. And here they come again. And that's a shot that has sailed miles over the bar. Oh, the substitution. And FC Romania are actually changing goalkeepers here. And it's Macromain who is coming off. And Lincoln Marquez is onto the field. And that's a decent effort from range. Oh, just wide. Tremaine Charles, what an effort. That's a lovely ball over the top and well taken down as well. And it might fall for them, it will. Oh, what has happened there? An empty net and he's fallen over. Well, here come FC Romania again. Haven't had much in the second half and that shot will fall through to the keeper. And I think he's kicked out again there, Coker, and he's off. Two yellows for kicking out, I think, at players. And, well, he's... Uh, Got himself a silly red card there. That's a good ball. Just a little bit too heavy. And they come again. Played through and it's a good chance maybe. Oh, just wide. In the end it wasn't the best of efforts. Eight minutes to go now. It's been a pretty muted second half. That's a wonderful touch though. And a good effort and a wonderful save. Marquez, who's come on in the second half, really good reactions. Oh, that's a loose pass, and they're through here, FC Romania. A big chance for them. It's played in, it has to be, surely, and it is six. And it's Jonathan Edwards. Well worked goal, good pressure again from FC Romania to put Kempston under the ropes, on the ball, and yet again they make use of their intelligent and quick forward play, and it's a wonderful finish as well from Edwards. Well, here come Kempston. I see Mo Romania might want to keep a clean sheet here. Oh, but they won't, because it's a wonderful goal. 
What a finish. Really, really good finish. And Charlie Hayford gets some form of consolation for Kempston Rovers. He won't need much. But at least the home fans have had something to cheer about. Wonderful goal, has to be said, from the edge of the box as well. They could have, could have done that earlier on. Who knows? That's another wonderful ball over the top. And they're in again here. And it's straight at Marquez. Kempston, I have to say, those balls over the top have certainly looked decent. They have had a few glimpses of good attacking play. But FC Romania have just been too strong for them. And they're going to play it out. And there is the full-time whistle. A huge result for FC Romania, not only for the goal difference, but also because it puts them on 28 points and only four points off where they were in the playoff places. A huge three points for them. They continue to push for promotion. Kempston Rovers, they remain in 17th, struggling just above the relegation playoff place. But a fantastic game for the away side. Six goals to boot as well. And we hope you enjoyed it here on WD Sports.